Hello everybody, welcome to Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. I don't know why it's taken me this long. You can tell I like Zelda, right? I don't know why it's taken me this long to play this game. Zelda's only my favorite series. And here I am. Right up there with Final Fantasy, which I've also not played on my channel yet, but we're not going to talk about that. So I don't know about you, but I'm really excited for Tears of the Kingdom coming out in May, and I wanted to replay this game before it comes out. And you get to experience it with me. I have played this before, but it was back when it launched. I played it to completion and then just haven't really touched it since. So it's really about time that I play through it a second time. Hello? Am I being born? Open your eyes. Ah! Why are you blinding me? You asked me to open my eyes, and then you friggin' blind me. It's like a prank. That's a lot of white screen for a long time. Open your eyes. Open your eyes. Am I at the dentist's office? Is that a light above me? Wake up, Link. Are you checking my molars? What's going on here? Oh god, I hate it when the dentist asks me to take off my clothes. Alright, take off your shirt and get in the pool. I'm gonna check you for some cavities. Yeah, I'd be looking left and right too, Link. You should really be questioning this. Check the walls for his diploma. For the love of god, check the walls! He's looking around, there's no diploma on the wall. Get out of there, Link! <laughs> I don't know why I've created this scenario where he's at the dentist's office, but here we are. Dude needs some pants. Dun, dun, dun. Dramatic close-up. Implying that I need to go to the door behind it and ignore it entirely, right? No. Guess I'll touch it. It's the new iPad 7 Pro X2. Is a Shika slate. Oh. Take it. It will help guide you after your long slumber. Are you implying that I can't find my way without technology in this world? In this day and age, you're probably not wrong. Ah. Controller vibrated and it scared me. Remember to update your firmware. It will take several hours. Your device will restart several times. Do you have a good Wi-Fi connection? You may need to step outside for a better connection if your Wi-Fi is not great. I'll do that after I open this. Probably has a shirt. Yeah. I remember the first time I played this, I forgot. Or, not really forgot. I didn't notice that second chest, and I just went around shirtless for the longest time, wondering to myself, why the hell was I not given a shirt yet? <laughs> I'm not a smart man. Up to the pedestal. That will show you the way. Do you know the way? Is this how you update the firmware? Man, it's got that hotspot connection. Sweet. Oh. Alexa, open the door. Actually, let me check around. No, okay. My Alexa devices are not plugged in, so I'm I'm safe. I don't need my apartment going nuts. <laughs> Link, you are the light. Our light. That must shine upon high rule once Actually, again. the light is in front of me. Now go. Man, I hope my connection is better out there. Ah, man, I'm already tired. Oh, well, guess can't continue my adventure. Zelda dies, the end. Let's go. God, I forgot about the stamina mechanic. I 
a glorious view. If Tears of the Kingdom doesn't start with a similar vista, I'll be very upset. Not similar looking, but same kind of like observing the scenery kind of scene. Sets the mood for the open world you're about to go explore. Do you have a moment to talk about our Lord and Savior by this church? Come meet me by the fire. I got a tree branch. I'm gonna beat the old man with a stick. After I get high on shrooms. Maybe this whole thing is gonna be like a, a fever dream from doing too many shrooms. I actually should have probably read that. How do I change my... Ah, uh, got it. I'm gonna push this rock for no particular reason. Aw, oh, I was hoping I'd go kill the old man. Ugh, fine. Guess I won't commit murder today. Hey, grab the apple. Grab the other apple. Excellent. Baked apple. It also took shrooms. <laughs> oh, he doesn't talk. I should probably voice him. <clears throat> oh. <coughs> oh, God, I can't do that. Normal voice. Forgive me, I could not resist pulling your leg. Please help yourself. An apple and an open flame make for a succulent treat. It is a bit strange to see another soul in these parts. Who are you? Me? I'll spare you my life story. I'm just an old fool who has lived here alone for quite some time now. What brings a bright-eyed young man like you to a place like this? Where are we? Answering a question with a question. That is fair enough. Is it fair? I find it kind of annoying when people do that myself, but you know. You do you, boo. As I cannot imagine our meeting to be a simple coincidence, I shall tell you. This is the Great Plateau. According to legend, this is the birthplace of the entire Kingdom of Hyrule. If you've played Skyward Sword, you might know the reference. My stick points this way. Camera is also going that way. Ooh. That temple there. Long ago, it was the site of many sacred ceremonies. Ever since the decline of the kingdom 100 years ago, it has sat abandoned in a state of decay. Yet another forgotten entity, a mere ghost of its former self. That, that's it? That's where you end the conversation? What are you doing? I'm relaxing by the fireside, of course. Although I'll need to cook myself another baked apple at some point, because you FUCKING STOLE MINE! Simple foods such as apples are fine to eat raw, but roasting them on a fire makes them tastier and more nutritious. I shall be here for some time. Please let me know if I may be of service. How do I... Oops. That's not at all what I wanted. How do I apple? Oh. No. God, I'm so rusty at this game. If you were expecting somebody who knew what they were doing to be playing this, you, you might be sorely disappointed. Baked apple? <laughs> Flaming apple? <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Ooh, secondary stick. Oh, it's a torch. Well then, just help yourself to that torch there. And how, may I ask, are you planning to use it, you fucking thief? Uh, to set things on fire. Mm. That is rather... Mm, unnerving. Please be cautious with that around any dry grass that might catch fire. You know, there are plenty of monsters in this area. That torch would make a good weapon, if need be. Mm. However, do not just swing it around without purpose. You must face your opponents and lock your sights on them. With the ZL button! That is a big... what is this? Oh, an axe. I thought the log was part of it. I was very confused. I am confusion! Am I going to church? Take me to church. Oh, what's down here? 
Ah! Didn't mean to crawl on top of that. Feel like I'm playing Assassin's Creed. No, Ezio, I don't want to climb on top of the door. I want to go through the damn door. What? What's happening? I'm floating in midair. Is now the right time? Head for the point marked on the map in your Sheikah Slate. Okay. Oh. Okay. I guess I'm not going to church. <gasps> Except I am. Oh god. Hey, hey, take stick to face. Hey, yeah. My tree branch broke. Secondary tree branch. Okay. Oh man, I hate the weapon mechanic. How it breaks all the time. I think that's the number one point of contention that people have with this game, is how frequently weapons break. The first bokoblin of the game broke my first stick, which granted is just a stick, but... It's gonna be a recurring theme, I promise you. Uh, come on. Break it! Break it! Break the thing! There you go. Whoa! Not what I expected. Eh. Okay, that one was safe. Choo choo! Chugga 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 chugga. <gasps> A chest! Hylian trousers. I think that might be part of the DLC. I do have the DLC if you were questioning that. I'm gonna go to church before I go to that point. Uh, is it up here? Yeah. Because I'm a pious man. And I must pray. Pray to the RN Jesus to give me some good loots. God, so little stamina. Come on. Oh, miss me. I'm going to use your own kind of club against you. It does help that you can pick up many weapons. It's supposed to negate the fact that they break so easily, but... Ah, it's still tedious to have to break a weapon, pick up another one, break a weapon, pick up another one. And growing up playing Zelda, the epicness of having a really cool sword that you could upgrade was one of my favorite things. And you just don't get that in this one. So the classic Zelda fan in me is just a little bummed. Still an amazing game, though. Despite that... Is this where I pray? Do I take a knee? Oh my god, I actually can't pray. I didn't realize. <laughs> I was just joking. The goddess statue smiles upon you. Okay, well... The deed is done. I set out to do something, and I did exactly that. Oh, it's a sound meter. I was looking at that purple thing on the bottom right, like, what is that? That's how much sound I am making. Can it hear me talking? Obviously not, but can you imagine? That would be really difficult to... Do a let's play if you couldn't talk in like a stealth horror type game. Like, all right, guys, welcome to my play. Oh shit, they spotted me! Run, run! Ah, don't slip, don't slip. Okay, no, you're good. Not that I really saw anything for you to grab onto there, but I'll take it. Another chest. Sweet. Nope, that's whistling. How do I get to my bow? It just told me. I don't see it here. So that can't be it. Now it's whistling again! Oh my god. 
Link, you're embarrassing me. Don't let them know I don't actually read tutorials. How do I get down? Ha! 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 Ow. Well, my knees are broken. It's official. Eh. Eh. Oh. Some arrows. Oops. Didn't mean to do that. But since we're doing it. Ah, the motion control is screwing with me. Oh, I can still walk around with this out. God, I'm like a tourist. Walking around with my phone camera out. Over there, you will see the great castle of doom. And over there, the volcano that is surely to kill many. <sighs> Anything in here? No? No. No? No. No? Man, I could go for an ancient screw right about now. If you know what I mean. <laughs> okay, let's go to the quest marker now and stop being stupid. Or I can go to the quest marker and continue being stupid. Yeah, I like that plan better. It's much easier to just retain my normal state of consciousness. Oh god. Um, I can push that rock on top of them. They'll never know what hit them unless they know what hit them and they know it's a rock. In which case, they will know what hit them. But I suspect they will not know what hit them. Especially if they continue looking away. Then when it hits them, they'll be like, I don't know what that was. And the knowledge of what hit me is the main concern that I have right now, not my broken limbs. <laughs> oh god. That was... Far more dramatic than I anticipated. I'll take it. Throw the barrel. And fail to break it. Oh, man. Work with me. Do I need to throw it against a rock? Nope. Ah. Oh, come on. Break. Break! What is in you? It's just a fucking apple. God damn it. Bokoblin horn. Can I steal the meat? Oh, I can. I can't remember. Does meat spoil in this game or no? I feel like the answer is no, but I don't completely remember. How do I... Oh, there we go. Got him. Oh, that was a pretty decent shot, if I do say so myself. Bokobo. Sounds like something out of Final Fantasy. I gotta ride my Bokobo. How do I crouch again? Ah. Making it easier to sneak up on foes and animals. Well, I dare say that is exactly what I appear to be doing. Sneak strike. Oh, yeah. Oh, a shield. And a sword. Sweet. Oh, wait. It's gonna break. Only somewhat sweet. Stick your iPad in the pedestal. Alright. Whoa! Sheikah Tower activated. Please watch for falling rocks. Well, that's concerning. I'd be backing up right about now. 
I guess you can't if you fall over like a doofus. The birds are like, I'm getting the fuck out of here! Oh my. It's like me in the morning, am I right? Have I? Oh yeah. How many of these towers are there? Oh man. Great Plateau Tower. Get it? Because it's a tower and we're on the Great Plateau. I know, I thought it was a unique name too. What's going on? A digital tier? Regional map extracted. Please take your updated iPad. All right. Remember what? You have been asleep for the past 100 years. Oh shit. The beast. So I feel like when I take a nap the in the evenings. Gains its true power. This world will face its end. Cloud Ganon? Is that you? Now then, you must hurry. Does that mean if I use my iPad to transfer files to the cloud, he's Before going to take it's them? Too late. Because he is the cloud. Follow the Sheikah slate. Complete. Now, how do I get down? Ugh, you're gonna make me climb all the way, aren't you? What's this? Oh, it's nothing. What's that over there? Giant flying mechanical bird. Nothing to see here. Just another day in Hyrule. Climb down. I'm playing Horizon Call of the Mountain, but in reverse. Climbing down instead of up. Holy crap, you're agile for an old man. My, my, it would seem we have quite the enigma here. There's no water in my butt. No, enigma, you idiot. This tower and others just like it have erupted across the land, one after another. It is almost as though a long dormant power has awoken quite suddenly. If you do not mind me asking, did anything odd occur while you were atop that tower? Hmm. I heard voices in my head! At least seventeen of them! Did you happen to recognize this mysterious voice? Uh, no. Hmm. I see. Well, that is unfortunate. I assume you caught sight of that atrocity in shrouding the castle. Hmm. That is Calamity Ganon. One hundred years ago, that vile entity brought the kingdom of Hyrule to ruin by leaking celebrity photos on the internet. It appeared suddenly and destroyed everything in its path. So many innocent lives were lost in its wake. For a century, the very symbol of our kingdom, Hyrule Castle, has managed to contain that evil, but just barely. He's not even inside the castle. How are you containing him with the castle? Anyway, whatever. There it festers, building its strength for the moment. It will unleash its blight upon the land once again. It would appear that moment is fast approaching. That moment is fast approaching. 
<laughs> I must ask you, courageous one, do you intend to make your way to the castle? Yeah, probably. <laughs> I had a feeling you would say that. You are an idiot, after all. Here on this isolated plateau, we are surrounded on all sides by steep cliffs with no way down. If you were to try to jump off, well, no death could be more certain or more foolish. Hmm. Of course, if you had a paraglider like mine, that would be quite another story. Paraglider? Oh, piqued your interest, have I? Yes, I didn't come soaring down here on my own feathery wings, you know. I mean, I did. I watched you, I know. Okay. Hmm. Were we not, I will happily agree to give you my paraglider, but not for nothing. I need about tree fitting. Hmm. Let's see now. How about I trade it for a bit of treasure that slumbers nearby? Main quest. Open your adventure log. After your descent from the tower, the old man told you that the kingdom of Hyrule was destroyed a hundred years ago. You heard a voice. The old man said he'd give it to you. Okay, everything I just mm. talked about. Okay. Come, let me show you something. I, I don't want to grab your penis, old man. It's dangerous to go alone. Take this. Hello. Ooh. Do you see that structure there? The one shining with a strange light. It began glowing at the exact moment those towers rose up from the ground. Okay, I've seen it. You don't need to stare at it. Okay. I would think such a place might have some sort of treasure, wouldn't you? Treasure for the paraglider. A fair exchange, I believe. Very well. I will get you your treasure, old man. And then I will keep it. All to myself. Kill you. Take the paraglider. Jump off the cliff. Probably not use it correctly. Break my neck and die. That is the sequence of events as I have planned them. Uh, as I recall, swimming is not always a great idea because stamina. I'm gonna go around. <laughs> Ancient screw. Hmm. Ah. Okay. Oh, I still see that bird in the distance. That'd be horrifying if you just, like, sped up to my location. Be worse than any horror game I've played. Omen Ow Shrine. Oh, man. Ow! I hurt myself. iPad confirmed. Step on the eye plate to open the eye door. Travel gate registered to map. Oh, right, you can travel between these things. I forgot that was a thing. Access granted. Enter for the eye elevator. Oh, there's a thing right there with EX right on it. Well, that's obviously DLC content. What's inside? A ruby? Okay. Don't know what that's for yet. Probably crafting. Down I go. I'm down like a clown, Charlie Brown. And now we get to watch this loading screen together. Oh, that was actually not too slow considering the switch's processing power. They did a really good job optimizing this game, even back then when the switch was new. I hope they do the same with Tears of the Kingdom, because I'm not going to lie, after playing Pokemon Scarlet and Violet, I'm a little concerned, but I have faith. Please don't ruin my Zelda. <laughs> Sheikah Slate Authenticated. Distilling Rune.
iPad now broken. You weren't supposed to get water on it, you idiot. Manipulate metallic objects using my magnetism and handsome good looks. Hey, metal. What are you doing tonight? How do I... Oh, right. Eh. All right. Second one. Second verse, same as the first. A little bit louder and a whole lot worse. Get out of the water. Because you're going to drown, even though it's not that deep. You're not that athletic. You've been asleep for a hundred years. You need to do some exercise. What can I do with this? Hey. Just kind of like gently nudge the blocks around. Okay. Oh no! Come here, block! Come here! <laughs> nice. That's gonna blow! Okay, fine. I thought I was gonna die! Ah, it's a bridge, which I probably need to take and move. Of a nah. See, I'm not completely stupid all the time. I do like this new um, idea that in old Zelda games when you saw a chest you had to be like, ah oh, shit, how do I get up there? Now I'm just like, ah oh, shit, let me just pull it towards me, because I'm lazy. Open the doors, throw wide the gates. Anything else in here before I leave? No. No. Alright. Then I will talk to- oh man! Ow! Boop. You broke my wall, you bitch! You have proven to possess the resolve of a true hero. You're really good at pushing blocks and opening doors. Please have my reward. Your trial was not that trialing. I am a humble monk, blessed with the sight of Goddess Hylia, and Dedica, I did not read that fast enough. With your arrival, my duty is now fulfilled. My duty was kind of lame, not going to lie. In the name of Goddess Hylia, allow me to bestow this gift upon you. Please accept this spirit orb. Just don't let it hit you on the head, because then you'll say, Oh man, ow, my head. It's inside of me. They're inside the computer? I got my heart back from breaking my legs at the church. May the goddess smile upon you. I will now disappear forever. Bye. Peace, bitches. Alright. And on that note, I will do the next trial in the next episode. Thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you join me in the next one. I will see you then. Bye-bye.